Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to another fabulous Let's Play session with me, your host, Chitty, for some more farming fun on Saturday. So, as we actually had stated, uh, today is the day that hopefully Link was supposed to actually rejoin us today, but I haven't seen him online at all today, so I'm hoping that I happen to see him at some point today. But uh, we currently have it in the works for some more farming fun. Now, those of you that are actually coming over from previous uh, attempts of uh, golf with your friends, truly sorry for all the profanity that came from me today. It's just very, 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 very frustrating. But, anyways, um, so as most of you could probably surmise that I've already managed to actually uh, finalize the last of Field 25. To be also grass as well, though I'm assuming we could probably make use of it for something else. Such as wheat, barley, something else of good consequences. But nonetheless, hopefully everyone's having a fabulous day. Uh, we do happen to have the radio turned on as well, so those of you that would like to put in song requests, you're more than welcome to do that today. Greatly encourage it, to be perfectly honest. Nonetheless, hopefully everyone's having a fabulous day. Actually, I'm going to restart my browser because for some odd reason it's still showing me that I'm offline, even though another stat is telling me that I am online. So, terribly sorry if anyone says anything here in the next... Uh, previous 20 seconds or so, I probably just missed a message from you. Nonetheless, we're just gonna kick back, relax, and have a little bit more farm fun. Never hurts to relax on the farm. Nothing more tranquil than mowing a giant, giant yard with a combine harvester. I guess if uh, if it keeps up, where uh, no one's truly interested in uh, joining in again, I'll uh, probably have to actually discontinue farming. So, um, but I'll just have to wait until enough folks sign up for it. Now, I also want to uh, truly apologize to everyone for yesterday. Apparently, uh, DNS issues with my ISP uh, kept me from being able to broadcast yesterday. So, hopefully, everyone else uh, had a uh, enjoyable time for those of you that were actually tuning into Warframe yesterday. Uh, and then I also tried to make up for it again today with uh, golfing with friends uh, when I was actually broadcasting with Crady Crew. Thank <laughs> you. 
Huh, that's really odd. It still keeps on saying that I'm offline. Well, it's semi-worked. Well, let's just do this. We'll go ahead and just start uh, grabbing all this up here.
Nice and slow. Come on. Hey, Renny! Welcome to the broadcast. Hopefully you're having a fabulous day. Farm Sim FTW, welcome to the broadcast. Hopefully you're having a fabulous day as well. So, Rennie, uh, were you able to get uh, some of the other mods uh, for other games that uh, we were discussing for the rest of the week uh, installed, or do you still need to uh, troubleshoot that still? Oh, that's okay. If you didn't get a chance, that's perfectly fine. special. What will you be eating for your picnic? Lunches for work? Wow. Must be a whole mess of sandwiches. picnic doesn't turn into something like a potluck where somebody was expecting you to bring something for the picnic and all you have to say is I bring you daisies freshly plucked from the grass at your feet because it's something I probably end up doing myself I'll be honest about Perhaps they're not being fully honest with you. Perhaps it's not a picnic. Hey, 
It must be a trap. Although it could probably be even more interesting. <laughs> but anyways, I just wanted to do the whole Admiral Ackbar thing. It's a trap! So, what did you pack for your lunches for this uh, for this week? As for me, I still need to go to the grocery store. I'll probably end up doing that tomorrow. So I'm betting it's a whole bunch of sandwiches, uh, pre-packaged uh, chips, and uh, maybe uh, assortment of fruits. We could go into work, uh, into work wearing a fruit basket, or uh, one of those little head baskets uh, full of fruits. What are they called? Um... Oh well, you can be a fruit top. Okay, let's go ahead and check stream elements, see if there's anybody that's still itching to join me for a live stream game. Hmm, nobody's put in a request to join me for farm sim. Okie dokie. I guess now would have been the best time anyways, since Rini's here. She had the ability to give you all the Discord access to be able to join me live in the game.
Ah, put in fresh, I see. Well, that'll be a fresh change of things. Hoping Link is okay today. I haven't heard from him all day. Well, uh, got in the, uh, in the works for tonight to harvest a whole lot of corn, potatoes, sugar beets, wheat, and barley. But uh, I was hoping to have Link in today, so that way we could also uh, showcase uh, cows. So that's the reason why I'm trying to get uh, his farm area set up for him. Uh, hopefully he'll be here soon, so that way I can just speed up time while he continues to do his work. Well, actually, I was hoping to have uh, both Link and Killer Dad in for today's broadcast, actually, but I uh, haven't heard from either of them. So, hoping at least one of them speaks up or something. <laughs> But if someone else is interested in joining, then I guess we'll have to do that as well, so... But uh, they'll have to still go through the process of being on stream elements, so...
But I guess if no one shows up, I guess I, if I happen to get done harvesting, I probably will call it quits for the night a smidge early then. So. Because there's been a lot of things I'd like to do list, and spending all day yesterday on the phone with my internet service provider was not one of them. Well, I wasn't saying you need to get the game. I was just saying, and if anyone else happens to actually get the game, then, I mean, they'll still need to go through and make sure that they have stream elements uh, fully functioning for them as well, and then end up joining in for the live stream. So, and even with that, that would be actually pretty awesome, so. Ooh. Well, let's see here. Ah, my information page didn't show up for me. Well, thank you for the host. Uh, I think, uh, Redneck Chevy, I'm assuming? Redneck, hopefully you're having a fabulous day. For me, I've just been having a very lengthy, lengthy day. Yesterday, having uh, internet service provider issues, and today also still trying to play this game with uh, only a single uh, keyboard and mouse configuration that's probably going to break down eventually at some point, so... Just need to get a new keyboard and mouse before I can actually do anything else food-related, so... Still have a few contests that I've been trying to get folks interested in for uh, for the hunter for the usual Wednesday hunts. Uh, I guess a lot of folks aren't really interested in earning the monies, or probably just don't have time to actually join in for the contest. I guess. And then uh, today we're supposed to actually have a few folks on today, but uh, I guess they're kind of a bit uh, MIA, so. <laughs> But how are you doing yourself there, uh, Redneck? Having a fabulous day? Taking in uh, and enjoying the weekend so far? Yeah, that sounds about average for uh, for all across the entire U.S. So, I mean, I know for my area the heat index is uh, about 120. So, dog managed to wake me up first thing in the morning. So, shoved her out the door, and about 30 seconds later, she realized, "Oh, I don't want to be out here. Never mind. Let me in. Let me in." <laughs> I changed my mind. I'm sorry for waking you, whatever, whatever. <laughs> Thank you. 
Actually, I guess I might as well crank up the music for y'all's selections that y'all are making. And I'll put in a selection of my own. <laughs> Oh, sorry, Spy, you just cooked dinner. Well, uh, at least I'll explain something if you go silent for too long. I'll call for an ambulance. If you're too sick. No, I'm just kidding. I'm sure you're a fabulous cook. After I just freaking got this combine stuck. Seriously, I got stuck on a hill. Someone's queuing lots of songs. That's the auto DJ. Auto DJ does a does a queue by itself. So. Goes through and selects songs for me when no one's picking songs, so... You have a higher attack due to lack of calories. <laughs> uh, and I'm really hungry now. What I wouldn't give for a nice juicy burger right now. Or perhaps, I don't know, maybe a 20 ounce steak, maybe. The side of garlic mashed potato. Or scalloped potatoes. I don't know. A form of potato would suit me, even if it's French fries. Or oh, sorry, I guess after a while, should also be saying should be potato chips as well. Um, but uh, let's see here. Actually, I could probably eat what I used to eat at Steak and Shake every single week when I was in high school, which was uh, a triple steak burger with uh, cheese and bacon and ketchup, uh, cheese-covered fries, and then a uh, Oreo chocolate, death by chocolate, chocolate shake. All forms of chocolate you could possibly imagine inside of an Oreo shake. That sounds like it's going to hit the spot right now, but if you're on your uh, zucchini pancakes, do the trick, I'll be interested to hear how fulfilling that is, or how tasty it is. But for me, I like the sweet stuff. Like, chocolate! I like the sweet stuff, but the sour stuff, that, that stuff can just go. I mean, garlic is one thing, and, uh, granted, I, I did, uh, I try to get, uh, try to get some crackers and cheese going for, uh, for my lunch today, and sure enough, 
accidentally left the sleeve where I shouldn't have, and so the dog ate all the crackers. So I had to go through and order a pizza instead. So all I got left to eat today is, uh, let's see, what do I got in this drawer here? A doily from earlier when I ate the last Milano cookie. Uh, some peanuts, and all these P3 protein packs. That's about all I got left. And, oh, wait, and a little Oreo fun pack. Well, I got really lazy. I asked them if they could order her, uh, you know, if they could deliver it to my window at my house. I moved the bed closer, so I wanted to actually be able to, you know, have a pizza, you know, breakfast in bed. And, uh, Jimmy John's, uh, would have been a, a nice option, except for the fact is that they've never been speedy or pretty fast. Besides, every single time I've actually ever tried to place a deli order, they've always managed to screw it up somehow. I mean, how hard is it to screw up doing lights amount of cheese and a couple slices of ham with a couple slices of turkey? I, mean, I don't want a whole lot. So what I always do is I'll actually put uh, baked Cheetos inside the sandwich and crunch it all in. Delicious. Uh, plus, the last time I, uh, actually, I think the last time our office ordered Jimmy John's, I went out to go pick up barbecue for the entire office, while the employees that were ordering Jimmy John's ended up saying, well, I just placed an order for Jimmy John's. And I was like, okay, well, I'm going to go pick up barbecue in about 45 minutes. Left, picked up barbecue, came back, and the other employees that ordered Jimmy John's were still waiting for their delivery. Everyone else had already finished eating the barbecue I brought back for them. I was freakier fast than Jimmy John's. Yeah, just mowing the grass while I wait for uh, other things to grow. Nothing wrong with a little bit of mowing. Granted, this uh, harvester is sexy. Gotta get a tractor. Never know what type of ladies I can attract with a 
the giant red tractor. I mean a combine harvester. Ooh, must be sexy. Granted, I've been trying to find some place here in the Kansas City area that actually makes a pretty decent uh, Philly cheesesteak. One that uh, that will definitely rival any of the other amateur places. some good places that are hard to find decent deli sandwiches. Now, granted, every single time I go into Mr. Goodson's, if I happen to step away for like a month or so, or any, any restaurants I happen to go into, and folks don't see me for like a month, they all assume I've died. I guess it's just because of how memorable of a person I am. Granted, there used to be, um, what was it, uh, the Caboose Cafe or something like that? Um, I think it was like someplace off of, uh, what was it? Someplace in Bonner Springs, I think it was? Supposed to have some really good cheesesteaks. Okay, that's it, I'm hungry. No denying my appetite for peanuts, steak, and sunflower seeds.
Am I wasting time? No, I'm not wasting time. I'm actually trying to get this area set up for, uh, for cows. Because, uh, yeah, this is, uh, what we're gonna have to do is, uh, fill the shaft as best as possible, and then, uh, compact all this, and then, uh, turn into silage. Somewhat level enough. <laughs> no innuendo intended. Yeah, it's okay. Happens. I'm grateful for you showing up, though, Sci Spy. You helped make a chat very interesting. Good to see you, John. Hopefully you had a blast watching uh, golf with your friends. I'm just asking before you lurk. I'm guessing you already did lurk. Okay, well, you came, you saw, you lurked.
Oh boy, that teriyaki beef. It's got to get a little bit of uh, a tamale kick to it. I mean, it's probably going to have some really bad heartburn tonight. But it certainly does hit the spot. I'm pretty hungry. So, anyone else happen to have a good tale of what they're eating for dinner, or what they've already had for dinner, or I guess for those of you that are in the UK area, it's probably very, very late, so what are you enjoying for a snack? Well, what's your bedtime treat, I guess? that whole time it wasn't giving me any anything at all yep didn't harvest any of that well crap Let's not go into the queue. Put a song request. Uh, let's check it out then. So it's not. There we go. That should work. Thanks for pointing that out, though, Sci Spy. <laughs> Points camera shoes. What are those? 
Oh my god, this is the most amazing thing ever! Thank god I'm recording! Oh wait, shoot, I'm only shooting my feet! Oh, I got away, but that was the most spectacular thing! It cannot be described, it can only be seen. Yeah. Wait, a YouTuber is being sued for being a nuisance? How the hell does that work? Is it a class action suit? Does that mean we can all get in on it? by the neighbors. Eh, not much. Eh, I guess I'll just speed up time. Well, I could easily see uh, the whole nuisance factor being uh, a major pain in the butt for, for almost every, every party involved, so... Hey, what's going on? Now I'm confused. Congratulations, gentlemen! You brought me confusion! Kink in your YouTuber life.
Ooh, congrats, Sir Spy. It looks like you're finally gonna get that top class high brow edumacation. Your mom went back in college and got her books yesterday. So your mother got wet and then was at college while she was wet and got her books. Very unusual, strange, and unusual means of events to get that. Oh, she went to college. Where I say, why would your mom get wet and then go to college? I mean, if unless it was a uh, you know a school for. Uh, what was it, um, aquatic knowledge or something of that nature? Something in the uh, studies of uh, aquatic life? Uh, what racist comment? Actually, on second thought, I don't want to know. <laughs> we'll leave that one alone. <laughs> I wish to plead the fifth. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. We got 15 is potatoes, 14 and 12 are sugar beets. I like potatoes. Oh wow, this is a pretty good song. What is this? Swamp Thing. Hmm. Potatoes are so grown, that's why. Okay, never mind. Hey, that thing was unfolded the whole time? That explains the space issues.
<laughs> well, I do expect AutoMod to actually do a lot of the, uh, the proper modding. It seems like... I'll, I'll, I know I, I broadcast a lot, so there's quite a f so few many number of mods that are able to make it to every single one of my broadcasts, so... Uh, Automod does do a pretty halfway decent job of moderating. Granted, it's not as evil as Nightbot. Or in this case, as most people like to call it, Nightbot. Holy crap, that's some messy sheep. These sheep are so damn messy. you two. Eat grass! And be merry.
right, I forgot I was gonna move that over here. Shilly me! Oh, right, I do need to take this over. Okay, the dog's acting kind of funky. So as soon as... Actually, here, I'm just going to do this real quick. Back after a quick break. Apparently the dog wants out, so I'll be right back, everybody. Feel free to go ahead and put in those song selections, and I'll return shortly. Sorry about that, folks. I am back. Dog just needs a little bit of loving to go outside. So, truly sorry about that.
holding. Oh, thank you! Didn't realize I had that many views to my channel so far. So anyways, now that I'm back, uh, what songs was everyone interested in listening to? Okay, never mind. I guess I'm down to zero viewers. Well, that can't be right. John's here! There's no way that could be incorrect. Okay, so I went from eight viewers to two. Kind of a bit devastating. Okay, now it also says I'm offline. <laughs> Is there anything true anymore in life? So John, if you're still the only one here, how you doing? How are those emojis coming along? I know I've been asking quite a few number of folks on uh, doing some of them, but uh, you're the only one that's actually been producing results that's offered to do it.
Oops, completely forgot about this. Okay, John, I guess you missed it. Uh, stepped away then. of stuff you should be making. Ah. Well, that can't be that bad. I mean, I still enjoy the design that you actually shared with everyone on the, on the Discord. And I do appreciate you actually giving it like a little monogrammed ice cubes for the GG icon. As a sniper, I kind of like that. I kind of like that idea. I actually would like to look forward to seeing all my subscribers with the sniper emoji as well. It's a shame we can't do uh, animated emojis.
Hmm. Well, it can't be very big. I mean, technically, the word sniper is short enough, but it's not lengthy enough to actually fit for an emoji, so... I mean, I'm sure if you folks are willing to provide a, an idea or two for, um, for the emojis for uh, Twitch, so... Foot's falling asleep. I've been sitting on my foot for too long. I'm sure a few folks would probably be willing to chip in a few ideas or two on the, what to do for the sniper emoji that you're thinking of. It's not gonna be enough, but hey, this stick gets rid of the top off. Oh, that's okay, Renny. Uh, we're just mostly talking about the emojis for you subscribers.
so far we got the uh, the GGJD with little ice cubes, monogrammed G ice cubes, but uh, I think those just need to be touched up a smidge. Then uh, John was also thinking of a sniper emoji.
PJ, welcome to the broadcast. Hopefully you're having a fabulous day. And to answer the sup, not much, just a little hungry. Got to get uh, replacement parts put together. Like, for example, mouse and keyboard, which is the current fundraiser goal, which I'm hoping I would have at least gotten a dollar by now. But, I guess I'll have to starve myself again. Plus, I know it's the summer break for a lot of folks, so kids are home, probably expend a lot more moonies. Well, I got a broken D key, and the uh, right mouse button doesn't exactly work on this mouse, so having to use the keyboard uh, with remapped keys on it. So I've mapped all the mouse clicks and whatnot onto my uh, onto my keyboard, and so I'm making use of that for most of. Uh, been doing that since actually the start of the year, so I just figured that if I actually had enough for food, I could probably afford it myself. But I haven't been able to actually get much in the way of the fundraiser. <laughs> so, and the spare mouse I got from another broadcaster ain't exactly working out, so. And then, let's see here, we also have subscriber emojis being talked about, publicly actually. Uh, we really happen to have one that's a shot glass with the, uh, the letters GG in it. Uh, another one uh, that John is wishing to try and do for himself, which is going to be a sniper emoji. Which I think will actually reflect this channel very well. So if you are interested in actually contributing to that uh, discussion as well, it's uh, I might actually create a channel on the... Uh, actually, John, if you want to, go ahead and create a channel. Uh, call it Subscriber Emoji Talk. And just go ahead and make it public for everybody. If you could, please and thank you. Because uh, I think that should be a discussion for everyone. Not just, not just my decision, but everyone's decision. Since you all are technically subscribing anyways as well, so subscribers do get the, you know, the majority vote. But uh, still, it's going to represent me and those of you that would like to actually sign on as Switch subscribers. So, you know, let's just do that, make sure that we get that taken care of.
And then, let's see, uh, PJ also had uh, DNS resolution errors with my internet service provider last night, so truly sorry to those of you that were looking forward to 911 operator. Although I did learn something very interesting about that game. You cannot exactly play the career option when you have no internet. <laughs> it tries to pull the career merely from the internet for the uh, for the maps. So <laughs> that was uh, that was an interesting dilemma to, to run across. Okay, thanks, John. But nonetheless, my question still does stand, PJ. How you been doing? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, right, the dog! I let the dog out. I'll be right back, everyone. Sorry, PJ. Uh, hold on to that thought. Well, I tried to see if the dog was out there, but it didn't look like she was there. So, moving on. <laughs> bad, bad. Heat, weather, asthma, and your sister's in town. Well, how bad can that be? If your sister's in town... Is that what siblings are for? To help create rivalry? But yeah, I'm, I, I kind of give up on trying to take care of the dog during my broadcast nights, so... The, the dog in question that I have, she's a little bit of a sneaky pup. Somehow, during one of my broadcasts, she actually managed to make it into this closed-off room and pester me when she wanted to go upstairs.
Ah, so your dog's in your lap. Will, will, will. Now I hear the dog barking outside my window. All right, now I'll be right back. Terribly sorry again. Alright, sorry about that. Now that the dog is back inside the house, there's not going to be another disturbance, hopefully. If there is, I will ask the dog to just wait. Mostly because this dog is becoming a nuisance to me. Slightly. Only slightly. I'm sure she's coming a nuisance to you, my loyal viewers. Although... Sure, she'll probably find some way to get camera time again sometime in the near future. Yeah, I'm sorry to keep on leaving y'all like that, but it's just... This dog, she is a bit of a nuisance, so... Pupper's always getting in the way! Although I think she's a smidge more self-sufficient than a cat. Just by a small manner. Because technically she does sleep all day.
what the hell is Upper Sea blocked by? I mean, hell, there's nothing here. Seriously, the helper is blocked by a frickin' tool shed. How hard can it be to just do this last part with the AI? Your skin is so try, my skin stings when I put lotion on it. Hmm. Well, Rennie, why is it low? Why is your skin so try? You wish for others to try on your skin, is that what you're saying?
Or do you just want to wait for the inevitable truth of somebody actually quoting Silence of the Lambs? <laughs> You're expecting somebody to honestly quote the movie. <laughs> it puts the lotion on the skin, or else it gets dropped in the hole again. There you go, there's your movie quote. So, I'm assuming uh, the, uh, the dry skin is actually due to the, uh, the inclined weather and excess heat. So how much lotion did you apply then, Renny? Not enough? Too much? Just enough? Or there's enough to create a second skin? It's a coat! You're wearing a coat of lotion!
I'm beginning to think I should have gotten the uh, the leveler from the, uh, from the mod that was actually designed for the wheel loader instead of the uh, tractors or the three point uh, the three point head uh, uh, leveler. Probably would have done a lot more good uh, over at the uh, silage silo. Think of any emoji ideas. Well, I would like to try and make use of spec oops. If you want to try and design something to be uber small that it happens to have the letters spec and oops uh, all in one major emoji. Because clearly I put the oops in spec oops when it comes to those tactical shooter games. Alright, we're gonna sneak in here and we are, they are gonna be none the wiser. Accidentally drop a flashbang. Well, oops. What do you think? Anyone else opposed to that idea? Because, I mean, I'm really, I seriously am open to a lot of emoji ideas, so uh, if anyone is actually curious about some potential ideas, 
feel free to discuss them here in Discord. More importantly, Discord, because in that way it's not lost to the recesses of uh, the chat in Twitch. But they'll be forever immortalized out on YouTube and Twitch. If it happens to make it into a clip.
Wow, chat is so quiet tonight. Well, anyways, don't forget, folks, you can still select the music. If you want to change it up from the regular Lee Tokyo, Sugar Rush, Rainbow Road, or even Fat Cat, y'all can select the music that you would like to have playing during my broadcast. Doesn't cost you a thing. Other than your time. to just simply type it in. They completed their task. Bull hockey! There's still a stock right there. So, 
much. So much corn went missing by the helpers. Okay, it looks like there's no more there. All right. Hello, what's this? Slightly darkened earth. Nope, nothing there either. Uh, it usually indicates that there's something left there. So, I guess we'll have to just be a little bit more thorough next time through. Hello! Thank you very much for the host there, Lukey. And welcome to the broadcast. Hopefully you're having a fabulous day. So much. Uh, things uh, could actually be a little bit more desired today. Uh, seems like everyone that was actually interested in joining me for Farm Sim really didn't decide to show up at all so far today. So, what I'm gonna probably do is once I uh, finish the uh, sugar beets, I'm actually gonna call it a quits for the night. So, but I do appreciate the host. Uh, I might finish up the potatoes, technically. Ah, it's okay. It's the weekend, too, so I'm sure folks probably forgot. So, bound to happen. But you're missing out, Luke. Uh, we're discussing emojis. So far, uh, the only thing we got so far is the GG icon. Uh, then we also happen to have uh, one for Sniper, and then there's another one that I'm thinking of making use of called Spec Oops. Okay, well, it looks like potatoes are still needing to be harvested. Uh, along with the... So we're on 11. We have wheat! Yeah, we'll get to that next time. Originally, the only reason why I had wheat was just to produce all the hay, so that we could move it on over here to the cow pastures. Uh, but since Link is not here, or even Killer Dad, uh, it's going to be kind of fruitless trying to move all that stuff and bale it all up. And then try and get it all plowed before then, so. So, yep, I think that's what I'll do. I'm gonna go ahead and probably call it for the night. So, I'd like to thank everyone for tuning in tonight. Uh, please stay in chat for your in stream bonus points. And uh, be sure to tune in again for tomorrow for the Orcs Must Die Unchained. Uh, I know that uh, both hijinks and I are looking forward to try and get some more uh, craziness and orc s total slaughter and craziness going on. So thank you again for tuning in, everyone, and you have a wonderful night. Please stay in chat to receive your in-stream bonus points, and I will see you all in the Discord for further communications in regards to the subscriber emojis. Thank you, everyone, and good night.